The weather is beautiful today. It's 70 degrees, it's low humidity, and there's a breeze. I might as well film some van videos. Little baby lizard. Just basking in the sun here. Okay, what I've got here is a portable toilet. It's pretty cool because it folds up real small. It's not like uh, the Lugaloo, which I have nothing against. But if you have the room, and you have the room, that's fine. But the Lugaloo, I don't know if you've seen that before. If somebody else talking about that. It's basically just a bucket, and then it has the seat on top, like this. But this is different because this actually folds up, and I'll show you after after I demonstrate how to use it. Now, I'm not going to take a crap in front of everybody, but <laughs> I'm going to show you how to put the bag in. So anyway, so anyway, it has a seat cover like this, and you can just sit on it. And you can also use it if you have one of those portable shower tents, you know, that you set up at camp. You can also leave this. Uh, on and leave it in there like that so it can be used as a restroom and a shower and you can sit on this if you needed to if there's not much headroom and you needed to sit down to you know take a shower in there you can also do that but anyway so when you want to use it it's real simple you get any of these bags that you just get at the grocery store and you put this through the ring like this make sure that the plastic is all the way on the outside of the ring like that and then you put it on here like this just go like that pull it and you see how that just that's not going anywhere it's not moving so then you just sit on that <laughs> do your thing and you're done now you can put you know kit kitty litter i guess or whatever you know if you wanted to put it, that in there but, I mean, if you're just going to throw it away and you have this double bag, like I just have one bag right here to show you, but I, you know, with the few times that I have used this, uh, I put double bags and just throw it away like you would a diaper or anywhere. I mean, you can throw it away any at any trash can. Um, but if you're like out in the middle of nowhere in a camp, you know, or whatever, um, I mean, at that point you could also, there's another option, you could just dig a hole and use it, <laughs> use the restroom like that. But, um... So anyway, it's good to have this option. You can, you have this, you know, to be able to use when you're not near a restroom. But uh, I just use this as, you know, as an absolute last resort. You know, there's public restrooms everywhere. Most of the places where I've been, even out in the middle of nowhere, at some point you're going to come across a restroom, whether it's a pit toilet or, you know, um, a fancier restroom at a campsite or whatever. You'll have those restrooms everywhere. But yeah, definitely uh, for long term, like boom, boondocking or whatever, this is cool. But I wanted to show you something else. Let me show you. So this is another thing I carry around. Uh, a shovel. So if you're out in the middle of nowhere and you don't want to use this or you don't have this, this is another option is just dig a hole, like maybe a foot deep or whatever, This, which this thing can do easily. Dig it. Take a crap in it. <laughs> Take some toilet tissue, uh, but don't put the toilet tissue in the hole. Uh, carry a bag to put the used toilet tissue in because, you know, it's not going to, uh, uh, what do you call it? It's not biodegradable. I mean, it is, but it takes a long time for it to turn into uh, mulch or whatever, <laughs> turn into something useful. But anyway, this is an option. Just dig a hole and use it like that, too. But, uh, okay, so let me... Uh, let me hold this up and show you how you do this. To put it all together. So you put the ring back here. And then this comes out right here like this. And then it just folds. Folds like that. It came with these uh, Velcro straps right here to kind of keep this together, but I don't know, it's just more of a hassle than anything. So what I do is, it came with this bag. Grand's Blicka, by the way. I think you say it like that. But you just put it back in the bag. 
puts in the bag all nice and snug. And everything stays together. So you got it all in here? Doesn't take up much room. See how skinny it is? That's it. That's how I crap in a van when uh, I don't have anywhere else to go. <laughs> One thing I forgot to mention uh, is not to pee in the bag. <laughs> That's only for poop. That's only for solid waste. Um, an option right here is one of these. I prefer to use this rather than a, just a plastic, regular plastic bottle, empty bottle of water. Um, this one's bigger and it's less, it's less noticeable. It, you know, <laughs> you can obviously see what's in the plastic bottle, but with this, it's hidden, and it's also made. You know, the top when it unscrews, it's made to um, so that you don't, you know, it doesn't spill or anything easily when you open it. So. Uh, these are like almost the perfect bottle to do number one. So, <laughs> so yeah, um, I was like, I made the video and I thought, oh, you know what, I forgot to mention about peeing. <laughs> so anyway, detergent, detergent bottle. Thanks for watching, guys. If you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up. And also subscribe if you're not subscribed already. And you'll see more videos like this, uh, van life videos, uh, me exploring, going different places, road trips. If you like those videos, then subscribe to my channel. Hit the notification button. You'll be notified when I release a video. But thanks for watching.